Hello, this is David, and I'm here to talk about communication. This is the first in a series of videos on communication, and this is about performing a solo in a small ensemble. Performing a solo in a small ensemble may seem one of the more easy aspects of ensemble singing. You might think you can just stand there and deliver your solo and ignore those people accompanying you. It is true that it, the accompanists are the ones that have to do the most to adjust the balance, but it is important that the soloist does not just ignore what is going on behind them or next to them. In some groups, the soloist steps forward and, that be and they obviously become the centre of attention for the audience. However, that's not something we do within the King Singers. We prefer to stay in our positions and it requires the soloist maybe to in some way with their body language indicate to the, to the audience that they are important. Here's an example of Chris Gabata singing the solo in home. First of all, not engaging the audience. of how not to do it. Chris was not engaging the audience and the rest of us weren't balancing to him. Perhaps we can show you how to do it in this following video which is the same music in which Chris engages the audience and the rest of us balance better to him. Another summer day has come and gone away in Paris or Rome the water go. So in conclusion, when singing a solo in an ensemble, you must always remember to balance to the accompaniment behind you. Enjoy your moment in the spotlight, but always remember you have to go back into the ensemble when you've finished. The corner is a banker with a motor car. The little children laugh at him behind his back. And the banker never wears a mask.